I'm back at the room. Getting ready to go do a little stretch. Get my stretch on and then I'm gonna go pick a spot out here and do my workout. I'm just gonna do 20 minutes because it's too goddamn hot to be working out. And the gym here is so small. And it's hot in there and there's mosquitoes. So I'd rather just pick a spot like right here on the grass, get my work on, and then uh, I'm gonna go over there and have a couple beers, or not beers, but a couple of tequila drinks. All right, see y'all in a minute. This is the gym, guys. Tiny, but I think this elliptical trainer works the stairs, the uh, treadmills uh, in op. So I'll see if I can get this done. I don't really like that. I'd much rather do insanity, but I might be able to touch up some shoulders with this machine and these free weights. So let's get it going, y'all. All right. All right, guys, insanity complete, 29 minutes. I'm soaked, 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 soaked. Sunset time. Look at that. Damn. So pretty. I don't know what beach this is, but it's deserted and really, really nice. So I guess this is Faka Beach. So this is Faka Beach here on the island of Morea. Sunset. Chasing gains all day. This restaurant here, local spot. So this place was pretty damn good, guys. Had the fish and chips. It's a little hole in the wall when they have parking. It's like a live aquarium, guys. Look at this thing. Right, it's day three here in paradise. Getting to really, really like this place, guys. Might be a new rotation piece. And it's only seven hours from LA. So that's a big plus. So now it's time to get some breakfast. Check out this walk. Go see if our friends from yesterday are out ready for more bread. They're ready for me to feed them. Let's see. Yeah, they're there. Just hanging out. 
like somebody's practicing for kayaks. And the moon is still up. Alright guys, it's time to go explore that mountain you see. And you guys I have to come out here. This place is so aesthetically pleasing. It's not really a bad view anywhere on this island. If you like the tropics, palm trees, nice trade winds, beautiful ocean, warm weather, this is right up your alley, guys. Jump in this hot ass car. Sunset Beach Park and this is the beach at that park no bad views here so far Hilton property. Their entrance is pretty nice. Let's go take a look. They have a koi pond here. That water is probably 100 degrees. That's why the fish barely moving. And they're staying cool over here on this side underneath the waterfall. Hilton has the overwater bungalows too. They're doing a lot of construction here. That was one of the reasons why I didn't book this property. On top of the fact that they wanted $660 per night to stay in a garden view room. Maybe if it was the price for those, I would have did it. But because the water's beautiful. So I was sitting down to have lunch. It just started raining out of nowhere. That's what happens in the tropics. It's still beautiful though. All right guys, so if you're torn between booking the Sofitel or the Hilton, I can tell you hands down, the Sofitel has the better beach. No construction. Hilton is under construction in parts. So you, you hear a lot of construction noise. Both of them have nice overwater bungalows and those are pretty similar as far as the water clarity. But the beach, so you tell wins. There's another beach here, guys. All right, 
right, this is the third beach in the beach walk edition of Morea. All right, let's go. As you can see, it's up against a mountain. And laced with palm trees. This little corner of the beach has a little bit of sargasso. But the water is crystal clear. The snorkelers are out. The dark, out, dark area out there is a reef. And it's sandy to walk out to the reef. Which is cool. And all beaches on the island Morea are public beaches. Where's the machete when you need one to crack open one of these coconuts? And now the sargasm is going away. This looks like the end of the beach, guys. and take a dip, cool off. Oh, so nice. All right. Yeah. Where are you from? Germany. Germany? Nice. Getting some waves with that or you just stand up paddle boarding? Uh, well, I live on a boat, so oh. I just want to go back, back home. So. Oh, uh, yeah? <laughs> Instead of taking the navy, oh, it's nice. a little bit less effort. Just sailing around the world. Yeah. Got it made. I started watching videos on YouTube about those guys that own boats and just sail around. Very, very interesting. Right. I'm but, tempted, but I, I've never sailed before, so. Neither did I. <laughs> cool little conversation with a guy that owns a boat. And I was just telling him I just started watching boat people on YouTube, like sailing La Vagabond and Parlay Revival, sailing doodles. I told him he needs to pick up a camera and start recording it. So I got this little pineapple. About the size of my palm. Sunset time, guys. Winding down a long day. Everybody's out here just chilling on the beach. Hey. Might I add, I got a crispy, crispy tan. Good to have the red man back. 
the original red man. What y'all think about the aesthetics of this video so far, y'all? Am I showing you guys a beautiful place or what? I'm trying to stay out of this video. <laughs> Sunset, still catching the tail end of the sunset from the property. It's nice too. Look at the little doggy. Hey, buddy. A little scaredy ass. is the last day in paradise time to get a little breakfast and reflect on the good times that were had see you in a minute cruise ship in cook's bay today azamara might not be a bad idea checked out of the hotel now I'm going to explore for a little bit before the boat leaves guys stay tuned one last view see you guys next time another thing guys if you come to Morea I would suggest you stay here and not on Tahiti Come to Morea, stay. But if you do stay in Morea, you make sure you rent a car because you definitely need one to get around. Taxis are sparse. You see them, but I'm sure they're probably $20, $30 each, each way you go somewhere. So the car was $70 a day. So that's a piece of advice, Morea tip. Driving up to Belvedere Lookout. Supposed to be a nice scenic destination here on the island of Morea. As you can see, the roads are very, very tight. So take your time when you're doing it. So this is the Belvedere Lookout, guys. As you can see, you are up pretty high. Alright guys, so that was 
Belvedere de Oponuhu. Opun no who. That's what it says. I might, might not be pronouncing it right, but I'm going to give you the sign here. Next spot for lunch in a bay. Let's see what they have. People got life figured out right here, man. On these boats, they live on these boats and just sail around the world. These are your views every day. What y'all think, man? Should I take up yachting? Rent me one of these things? Or I don't even know the first step into acquiring one but maybe maybe who knows anyway i'm gonna eat some lunch lunch is served with a garlic shrimp rice little pineapples Thanks, chefs. It was really good. <laughs> so that was lunch here. Very tasty. A lot cheaper than the tourist traps, too. And they have parking right off the side of the main road. put the name of the restaurant in the text and I sure don't know it I forgot already these names are like hard to see the name of so back at the port of Valle Ari Morea Tahiti and this is the boat taking us back wish y'all could smell this Aroma coming off of this table it smells so good. This is the boat. Time to go, Maria. You were wonderful. This feels like I'm in Greece, jumping on these ferries, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I'm tanned up, really dark. Being out in the sun, three straight, four straight days. Air conditioned boat. Feels good. All right. Oh, if I didn't mention, it's 25 US dollars each way on this boat. So we just prepaid at the Papiete boat pier and kept the ticket and got back on. So pretty easy. in the airport y'all time to head on out good stay anyways heading out see you the next time Tahiti airport has a little outdoor grounds you can blaze up your cigs if you smoke change clothes and now it is time to get up on this plane guys thank you guys have a good one up the trip here came in on Tahiti Louis going back on Delta 767